You okay? Status report. I've uploaded the corrupted files from Dr. Sandsmark's last message. Running it through repair algorithms now. I can recover it, but it'll take some time. Hello, team. I received the third fragment. What have you found out? I searched the Watchtower database for relevant matches. The statue, what is left of it, is thousands of years old. Carbon dating suggests second millennium BCE by surface world reckoning. It is engraved with a combination of ancient Babylonian cuneiform and something else. It almost looks like a circuit board. This is an obscure drawing from a Babylonian temple scholar, second millennium. Notice the similar carvings. Certain xenology specialists have suggested this could be evidence of an archaic alien race. The statue depicts a primordial chaos creature named Tiamat from the legend of Tiamat and Marduk. The story is one of the oldest recorded versions of what your scholars call the Chaos Conf myth. The Chaos what now? The Chaos Conf myth. A story that represents the battle between chaos and order. <laughs> I hate the fuzzy sciences. In this version of the myth, Tiamat was set loose to destroy the world and put an end to the conflict. So the gods issued a summons for a hero, and Marduk, a young demigod from Mesopotamia, answered the call. Marduk was said to have petitioned the Four Winds to create lightning and rain to defeat Tiamat. After that, Marduk was inducted into the Babylonian pantheon, and his name passed into legend as the God of Gods. Lightning and rain? I have that covered. Does that mean Marduk was some kind of ancient superhero? That is the theory. Solid work, Aquagirl.